Okay. Can you tell she's got a gun? Walk, turn around, turn around. You can't hardly tell it. You can a little bit if you look real close. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I'm sorry. You can a little bit. <laughs> where is it? Well, show them where you got it. I gotta show you where I got it. You're never gonna believe where I got it. You can see it, but you barely. <laughs> yeah. This chick's wide hurt, man. Anyway, see you later. Hey, this is Frank with Frank and Tina, and this is Bane. And welcome to another to a Saturday video. Um, anyway, what we're doing today is we're going to do a little review on this Taurus G2S. This particular one is in desert sand. Uh, we got this one on a, a recommendation from Pro Carry Trucker who told us it would be a good one for Tina for a... Um, for a uh, no print uh, carry and it is good because you see how thin that is it does not have a double stack henceforth the S the G2S uh, it means slim it's a slim line so there's no double stack uh, clip in it it's just a single stack clip it doesn't hold a whole lot of rounds but it's got what you need it it's uh, chambered in uh, nine millimeter and uh we'll, well well put them in here um so anyway it holds two three your shoes are not three four five six and one in the chain well, I think it'll hold seven in the clip. Seven in the clip, one in the chamber. We got six. So, anyway, it holds. So you can see the yellow one for seven. So, I hold seven in the in the clip, one in the chamber. So, it'll hold eight rounds, which is, you know, pretty decent for a, for a firearm this size. I mean, this is this is a small firearm. Uh, it's pretty darn accurate. Um, she can She can shoot it real well. It's uh, easy to operate, easy to function. Um, I mean, everything works nice and smooth on it. Notice it's not got one in there. And uh, anyway, it's got a safety on it right here. There's your, it's hard to do while doing a video. Oh, well, you got a clip in it. Anyway, you can pull the safety up right there. And then the thing is not going not gonna to fire. Pull the safety down and this thing is ready to go. So it's pretty easy. There's not a whole lot of things there to, to stop it. Um, very good, little nice gun. We bought this one, I think, for 250, 260, somewhere around in there. I think we got it at Academy Sports. Uh, I think it was like 256. Uh, anyway, they've gone up a little bit in price. But it's a very nice one. And uh, I'll tell you what, we keep all of these guns locked up behind a big safe, do we not? And they're locked up and hidden, are they not? We don't ever leave them laying around, do we? No, we do not. We're extremely careful of them. And you know very well what a gun will do because you've seen a fire happening. And you're, are you afraid of them? You won't touch one ever, would you? No, no, no. I think it's a good idea to teach children about these kind of things. It's if they see the guns fired, they don't think it's a video game. They understand what they'll do, and they understand how dangerous they are, and they're pretty darn scared of them. Okay, we're going uh, we started taking Kaylee uh, shooting when she was, you know, pretty young. And let me tell you what, she does not want any part of a gun. She stays as far away from them as she can get because they're loud and they're scary, and uh, she knows what they'll do. Um, most of the times when there's something that happens with a child, he doesn't he doesn't know what's going on with the guns but anyway this is our 2a saturday and uh our point of view is a little different than some people's point of view you think that well we need more gun laws and why do we need more gun laws we need more gun laws to so people can't get guns well here's the thing the crooks are gonna get the guns 
they're going to get it. The evil people are going to be able to get the guns. They're going to get them, you know, uh, through the black market somehow. But what they're saying is we can't buy our guns, the legal people who follow the law, we can't go and buy guns. That's what they would like for it to be. And then how are we going to defend ourselves against those evil people out here that do have guns? If uh, everybody carried, like, you know, the Constitution talks about, you wouldn't see any of these shootings that was going on because people would be afraid to do it because they'd know somebody would pull a gun out and kill them the minute they tried. And that's that's the thing. That's Sam Colt, you know, people used to say that in the, in the Old West. They'd say, you know, God made, made all men, uh, created all men, uh, well, I forget how that saying went, but it's something about God did not create all men equal, but Sam Colt did. So anyway, that means he made the gun, which equalized everybody. You know, because you could have a guy as big as me, I'm 400 pounds, and I'm fat, but I'm, I've got a lot of muscle. I work hard every day. So if you have me go up against a guy that's 135 pounds, that's not a very fair fight. But when you involve two of these, I have one, he has one, we're dead equal except for, you know, who has the best ability with their firearm. And uh, who, who, who's the one that's better at shooting it? Is the only thing, who's the one that's calmer headed, calmer minded. But if you use these and you use them, you know, well as home protection, and we've got them as home protection, we got them as our self protection. We go into some areas sometimes, like you gotta go to the Georgia Aquarium. You're going through, you know, we take these kids up there. We're going right through the middle of downtown Atlanta. I don't think it'd be very responsible for us to take these children through a very bad area without carrying a firearm. But anyway, if you're considering on getting one, this is a very good one. Very good one, especially for ladies, because it does not print. It's real light color, so she can wear this under a, a t-shirt or whatever, and it's not going to show up. That's the reason we picked this color. Uh, and this is this is what ta this is Tina's EDC. It's her everyday carry, and it's a very good gun, and uh, it's a very uh, fairly safe gun because the way she carries it, a lot of people don't agree with it, but she doesn't carry one in the chamber, and she keeps the safety on. But she can extremely quick rack one up and pull that safety off, and she can shoot the, the eyes out of a bird flying. Uh, that girl can shoot. So anyway, this is her you know, primary uh, everyday carry. And uh, anyway, this is our 2A Saturday here. And I just wanted to, you know, let some people see the other side because there's two sides to every story. You know, a lot of people say, well, you know, no guns. The guns are uh, not something uh, we want, so we want to outlaw them all because if we outlaw them all, there'll be no more shootings. Yes, there will still be a lot of shootings. There'll still be just as many as there are now. The only difference is the one in Illinois that happened where that guy... He only killed. He only killed three people. I mean, it's only three. That's a lot of people. Three, okay. but within two minutes they shot him. Hey, Katie. Okay. Well, I gotta go. Boss is hollering. But thank y'all for watching the video. And uh, if Tina, what do you think about this little G uh, no, G2C? Here, yeah, you hold. Hello, y'all. What do you think about this little G2C? I think I look good. Oh, you ain't good. <laughs> <laughs> That's good too. You like I it? love it. It's lightweight. It's easy to carry. I think Pro Carry Trucker give you a good uh, recommendation in that. I one. do too. Thank you. Gotta Thank go. you. Love you. Gotta go. See you guys later. See, I mean, this, this is my family here. Give it the goes around me. We need to protect them. So, henceforth, we have a means of doing that. And uh, look at me. Anyway, love y'all. See you later. Bye.